first of all to install java 22 using homebrew of course the homebrew should be installed in your system then we will open up the terminal like this and here we will run this command which is java space hyphen version so it is unable to locate a java runtime which means the java is not installed in my system currently now we will run this command which is brew search and oracle hyphen jdk and hit enter now in the result we are interested specifically in this oracle hyphen jdk now before installing this we will first check the information about this particular class for that we will run this command which is brew info and oracle hyphen jdk here we will verify the version once so this is 22.0.1 which is the latest version in the current moment but in future it might be possible that this same cask this oracle hyphen jdk will be updated to install any new version for example 23 24 or even more latest version so it's better to check the information first by running this brew info command and make sure that you are installing the desired version only now let me clear the terminal once and to install this we will run this command which is brew install and oracle hyphen jdk and hit enter now we will provide the password for our macbook here we can see that the installation is successful now we will verify the installation once and for that we will again check the version using the same command java space hyphen version this time we have got the desired output here it means the jdk 22 is installed now now there is one more thing that if we check the value for java underscore home variable then it is empty for now it is better to set this particular value as well otherwise java might not work properly in some cases so we will set the value with that path where the jdk is installed so let's go to that location first where the jdk is installed so first i will go to the library so i will say cd forward slash library forward slash java then forward slash java virtual machine i will hit enter if i do ls here then we will see this jdk 22 jdk this particular folder so i will go inside this folder i will do again ls here so there is this contents folder so we will go inside this as well and we will do ls again now we will see this home folder here and we will go inside this home folder as well and here we will run this command which is pwd so this is actually the java home folder which we need to set the path of in the java underscore home variable and in this home folder itself all the binary and the library files are also present which enables java to work properly so we need to set this particular path in the java underscore home variable and we will set this value permanently in the zshrc file or the bash underscore rc file so if your mac os version is catalina or the higher version then there will be the zshrc file or in case if you are using the lower version than catalina then there will be the bash underscore rc file and we can check that in the home folder by running this particular command which is this ls space then hyphen la then tilde and forward slash so as you can see here for me it is the zshrc file not the bash rc file so i will open up this particular file using the vi editor so let me clear the screen first and i will do the pwd again and i will copy this particular path let's now use the vi editor so it was the zshrc file now here i will press the i key on the keyboard to move into the insert mode so as you can see the insert is written here it means we are into the insert mode now now here i will write java underscore home equals to and i will paste that copied path now to move out from this insert mode i will press the escape key on the keyboard so the insert is removed from here now i will write colon w and q and i will press the return key of the keyboard and now we will source this particular file and for that we will write source space tilde forward slash dot zshrc and we will hit enter so the file is also sourced now now let's check the value of java underscore home variable again so i will type echo dollar java underscore home and i will hit enter 
so i got the set value in the output so the path is also set now i hope the video was useful to you